Hi, I'm Stuart and I'm the owner of Your Car Haggler and I wanna be your car haggler. I'm a licensed auto broker helping you save time, money, and the aggravation involved when it comes to buying a car and all of the games that come with it. This series is all about auditing car dealerships and the deceptive tactics that they use and how you can avoid them. Let's go. I was hired to help a client find a red Honda CRV EXL with gray interior. Where they live, I knew that it was gonna be a little bit of a challenge. A lot of dealerships in that area want to try to charge over MSRP or add unnecessary things like nitrogen or paint and protection. So I started to look and I found a website that was showing a $2,536 discount. And I had a feeling it was too good to be true, but I looked at their disclaimers on their website and nowhere did it advertise that they were going to be adding any sort of packages. I had a feeling something might change when I reached out to them. The audio that you're gonna hear is what happened between myself and the car salesperson. Take a listen. When I come back, I'll talk to you about how you can potentially avoid the games that were played or tried to be played. Uh, online is showing at 34,369, which is a $2,500 dealer discount. Those are actually um, discounted from our corporate office. So I, I don't, unless I were to go to our website, you know what I'm saying? I wouldn't, that's why I was asking you what the price was. So um, are you familiar with the, um, are you familiar with the, um, the um, uh, protection package that we put on our vehicles? Are you familiar with that? No, I, I don't know why it would be. It doesn't state it anywhere on your website or on this page. Okay. Yep. So, so our protection package is something that's going to help you kind of down the road, of course, uh, you know, protecting your vehicle and also being worth more as well uh, down the road. So on our vehicles, we do um, give you the all weather mats on both rows. We also give you splash guards. So no gravel or dirt hit your paint. Um, we also give you the rubber trunk tray, and we also tent the vehicle as well on site. Okay, so what is that about okay. six ninety nine? No, it, it's not six ninety nine. Um, you know, but it is very minimal. Um, it's one ninety nine nine, and you know that includes all of that. What do you mean one ninety nine nine? A nineteen nine ninety nine, which would be t basically just shy of two two thousand um, dollars, and that is and that is minimal. Okay, can you explain um, to me how mud guards, mats, trunk mat, and tint are is two thousand dollars, and you're trying to call that minimal? I mean that that has a well, most dealerships, yeah, most dealerships charge, yeah, most dealerships charge anywhere from thirty five to forty five hundred dollars. So how can you try to charge? two thousand dollars for something that isn't disclosed on your website like it, it doesn't mention anything about a protection package that's why we're on the phone like it doesn't say that anywhere on your website. i don't know why it doesn't say that on there i thought that it did I, i'm not sure when people shop the internet corporate intentionally puts that stuff on there to get people into the dealership but as far as the accessories most people do want those accessories because you got to realize that if 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 we weren't discounting that car you know 1800 or, or whatever we're discounting online then you would be paying two thousand dollars more anyway but we're discounting it so that's what gets people in so you're admitting and, i mean it does to the, the pricing game, you're admitting to false advertising. Is that what I'm understanding? Like I said, I don't know if it says it about the accessories or it doesn't. I, I don't know what it says online. Because I'm telling you handled. it does. I mean, I'm telling you it doesn't. I, I can't be the first person that's mm -hmm. mentioned that as well as $2,000. You actually are. So let, um, let's do some math let me, together. Let, let so me do this. Rubber mats are... Yeah. Let's say rubber mats are 249. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. That's what we're charging. But our cost, our cost on that is a thousand dollars. Our cost. No, it's not it's, on all of that. It's not. There might be some crazy owner mm -hmm. pack in there, but we both know that is not mats. Mats yeah. with the floor mat and well, the back. Well, this is 49. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, is an agreement that Honda, Honda has. Yes. No, this Honda is not has with Honda. With this our is dealership. With your, this is your dealership just trying to get more money out of people. Can I can I talk to a sales manager? 
you're saying this like you actually believe okay. it. Yeah. Let me do this. Give me your number. Listen, I just I'm trying to be transparent. This is what we do at our dealership. It is very minimal because most dealerships charge you two thousand dollars just for a market adjustment and they don't give no, you anything. That's not I mean not the dealerships I'm talking to. One's taking off. Well who are you talking to? dealerships that have the car that we're that we're interested in and it's it's an EXL front wheel drive. So we're talking to a few different dealerships. If it was on your website and it said that we add this to it, it's not on your website. So that just to me is just, it's, I, I, if I'm the first okay. person that's ever had an issue with it, well, strike me down. Right. But um, give me just a bit and I will give your number to them. Okay. Thank you. You might be wondering why did I continue to talk to this salesperson after they informed me that this is the way it is, this is the way it is. My job as your car haggler is to get you the best deal. So if I harp on that salesperson and I harp on that salesperson and I continue to grind them, they say, then they might say, you know what, if you come in and you take this car, we will offer that or we will charge you less or we will discount the car more. That is my job for you. There are some dealerships out there that will advertise underneath the MSRP or the sale price of their vehicle that they will add some sort of protection package. I have run into that. There are some dealerships that want to try to add it. They're going to try you on for it. There are some dealerships that are just completely handling it the wrong way. And this dealership is very much handling it the wrong way. Somewhere on their website, just from what the salesperson said because he thought it was on there i'd like to think that he knew it wasn't on there but a car salesperson is going to tell you what a car salesperson is going to tell you so how do you avoid this i definitely recommend reading the disclosures on any of the websites that you're on is there even something as small as this does not include dealer installed options or accessories. If it's on there, know that you're likely going to get into that when you talk to them. But how do you completely avoid this? You hire me. I want to be your car haggler. I help people all across the country save money. Well, what did I wind up saving this client? $1,500 from MSRP, no add-ons. The dealership that I initially spoke to that we are buying from, which is definitely different than this one, told me that they wanted to charge MSRP plus about $2,000 in ads. Well, dealership that I spoke to on the phone and you listened to was trying to take off $2,500 to add $2,000. I said to this dealership, if you want to earn our business, it's gonna be $1,500 from MSRP, no ads. After a few days back and forth, they agreed. So I helped my client save $1,500 with no added junk. Overall, in my opinion, the dealer group and the dealership get an F. Their deceptive tactics, even admitted by their salesperson, would lead the average consumer to go in thinking they're about to get a great deal on a car, only to then be told that, no, sorry, we're gonna give you $2,536 off, but then we're gonna take back 2,000 of it, but include only about $700 worth of accessories. In my opinion, the salesperson gets a C because they very quickly inform me that there would be some sort of addendum on the vehicle, but then try to defend that the value of those products put on the car was $2,000. But they kept cool under all of the questions that I asked them. Never settle for what a dealership is telling you but you don't even have to talk to the dealership. If you hire me, I do it all for you. So please let me help you beat the Steelership, beatthestealership.com or yourcarhaggler.com. Thank you for watching this episode of Auditing the Steelerships. I'm Stuart, your car haggler. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, comment, tell your best friend, tell your worst friend that I wanna help you and everybody you know beat the Steelership so they don't screw you.